home, huh? Yeah. But not really. No, no, it's perfect. You know what would really make it feel like home? What? Home. Airline tickets? Flight leaves at midnight. You'll be home Christmas morning. Oh, my God. Thank you. We're never going to forget this. Maggie, look. I know. We're going home. You guys, I don't know what to say. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Jenny. Merry Christmas, Max. I love the holidays. <laughs> TV, another case for Judge Judy. She would get emotionally upset around me for reasons that I weren't I was not able to communicate with her why. That's what he says. She says it was because she rejected him. There were a few times that he'd come on to me and uh, I kind of turned him down and after that it, it just went downhill. You are about to enter the courtroom of Judge Judith Scheindlin. The people are real. The cases are real. The rulings are final. This is her courtroom. This is Judge Judy. Parties on Sudol versus Hendricks. All parties on Sudol versus Hendricks. Step forward, please. Mary Ann Sudol shared an apartment with a perfect stranger, Paul Hendricks. She says things got hot when she turned him down, and he said, get out. Order, all rise. Judge, this is number 15 on the calendar in the matter of Sudol versus Hendricks. Thanks, Judge, the parties have been sworn in. You may be seated. So let's start at the beginning. OK, um, about six weeks after I'd moved in, Paul How did you find him? That's first. Oh, just me and my girlfriend riding down the street, and I was looking for an apartment in Manhattan Beach, and uh, we came across the sign, the for rent sign. 